I think it like the story itself. I think is really good. Like there's like this whole kind of theme to it about you know confronting your past, confronting your fears, which I really like. And they kind of put in this whole really interesting idea about this you know board game that uh, comes to life basically and fucks shit up. And I, I think it's a very entertaining movie. Uh, the reason why I say it doesn't hold up too well is like mainly because of the effects. Like the the monkeys <laughs> let's not talk about the monkeys in Jumanji they are so bad um, but Robin Williams gives a great performance uh, as, as well in this and uh, Kirsten Dunst who I've always had a crush on it wasn't weird because I was I'm, I'm like her age I think I don't know I think maybe she's a little older than me I don't know Kirsten call me um, anyway, I, I think it's a decent movie, except for those monkeys, and in some parts the lion, and in some parts the elephants. But what you'll notice is what holds up extremely well in the movie is the practical effects. Like, you'll see the, the plants that, you know, like the things come out and like grab you. I think that holds up really, really well because it's a practical effect. It's not CGI, so CGI was still kind of being perfected. But like Jurassic Park, obviously uh, set the set the way uh, for CGI and creating kind of realistic uh, kind of physical beings, as opposed to say the Abyss with with the tripod or the T1000 in Terminator 2 or Flubber and Flubber. Actually, did Flubber come out after this? I don't even know. But whatever.